eyeliner can sense fear. If you're scared, there's don't even bother. Don't even bother, girl. Just walk away. Hey beautifuls, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new, hi, I'm Finn and I post content twice a week. In today's video, I have honestly got such an exciting video for two main reasons. Now the first reason, this video is actually a collab with a bunch of other amazing creators. Now I'm going to link all of their channels in the description box down below. Honestly, check them all out. They are honestly some really, really lovely girls. Um, I'm really, really glad to have met them. They're just wonderful. They're really, really nice humans. They're nice humans. So, in today's video, as you can see by the title, I am challenging myself. In today's video, we are doing a makeup look, but there's a catch. I'm not allowed to use the hand that I normally use, so my right hand can go by. We are completely doing this look on my left, left hand. I just, I'm not sure how, how well this makeup's gonna go, so we're gonna try it anyway. The second core cool reason is that obviously this is going to be uploaded on Sunday. Sunday, yeah, which is still Pride Month, and I really wanted to do something Pride related, something Pride themed. So we're going to be doing a Pride themed makeup look using just my left hand, not my right, and we're gonna see how well it goes. The first thing I'm gonna be doing is priming my face. I'm gonna be using the PS Primer. I've been using this for ages and I still have like loads left. Oh, no. Fan, fan, left hand fan. Okay, in order to create this look, I'm actually using three different palettes, which is not unlike me. I tend to normally have like seven, eight out in order to create one look. So I'm going to do my eyes first and then my base, just because I know for a fact there's gonna be so much fallout where I'm gonna be awful with my left hand. So I'm gonna be going in with some concealer for my eyelids first. And we're going to be using this Winky Lux one. I actually got this concealer out of a birch box. Um, I'm not sure how well it's going to go or whether the shade is right, but we're going to be trying this one out. Wow, no, we're not using that. First error encountered. <laughs> no thanks. <laughs> so now I've taken that off, I'm going to be going in with my MUA Pro Base one. Um, I find that this is obviously a much better colour match. <laughs> oh my god, I can't even hold it. Awesome, so I quite clearly want the rainbow shades on my eyes, so the first colour I'm going to go in is with a... Uh, what? <laughs> the first colour I'm going to go in with is a red. So for the red shades, I'm going to be going in with my Coca-Cola by Morphe Collab palette, which I freaking love. I've got a full review, I'll leave it up, up here. It's not really a review. I've got a testing video, I'll leave it up there. And I'm going to be taking my Morphe by Jeffree Star detailer brush, and I'm going to pop the red shade in the corner. I'm just going to carry on from that. It is so pigmented, this stuff, so if this goes wrong, it's gonna go really, really, really wrong. Um, <laughs> I don't know how to hold my brush! <laughs> okay, so I'm going in with the Roxaurus Colour Burst Palette, and I'm gonna be going in with the shade Bang Bang. My fallout is awful. Get rid of it. Oh, now I've just swept it into my nose. What am I doing? Right, we're gonna go in with the shade Lemonade out of the same palette and just pop that in the little bit. I cannot for the life of me do my eyeshadow with my left. Oh my god, guys, right. I think that's the best I'm going to get for that eye. So now I want to start again. Oh, I'm sticking to my chair, it's too hot. Right, so that eye's nearly done. I'm going to be putting on some glitter over my lid because I love the glitter that I've got. And then we're done with the eyeshadow. Thank god. So. 
This side is obviously going to be green, blue and purple in whatever order it's meant to be. I don't think this side was... <sighs> it's not great, okay? We know it's not great, but... Is it better than what I thought I'd be able to do with my left hand? Yes, so let's just crack on. I won't lie to you guys, my green and my purple are not very pigmented. If you've got a really good um, a green and a purple pigmented, no fallout, no chalky eyeshadow, then please put it in the description box because I'm after one so freaking badly. So I'm going with my Roxaurus palette again. I'm going to be taking the shade Dinosaur. I cannot wait to get to the base. The base is going to be the easiest bit. Like I said, this is the only green I've got is this really light pastel one. So now I'm going to be taking the shade Blue Lagoon, which is a really, really nice bright blue. Can't, I cannot physically move my hand around to where I want it. I just don't have a good green. Like, if you guys have got a green that's neon green, please let me know. The last palette I'm going in with is my W7 Vivid palette. Now, these palettes are honestly my go to's. How stunning is she? She's freaking beautiful. Oh, we are not even. Babe, we are, we are far from freaking even. Are you ready for this? Because I don't think you are. Let me just, look, hang on, just pause yourself for a sec. Breathe. Because I honestly don't think you're ready for this little bit. We're going in with the glitter. I fangirled over this so hard in my last video and I swear to God, I'm gonna fangirl again, okay? We're gonna be going in with this shade here out of my Coca-Cola palette. Now, this is the best glitter, hands down, I have ever used in my life. And it comes off your face. So if you want a good glitter, a lot of pigment payoff, and it washes off. Got you one. Ooh, glitter! I think that's the neatest I'm going to get it. Right, beauts, onto my base. You already know the drill. You know the drill if you've been here for a little while. I'm going over my W7 Legend. Long wear lasting foundation. This is the dupe for the Estee Lauder one. And I say that in every single video, literally because it, it hand on heart, is a brilliant foundation. And it's three pounds something. Girl. It doesn't, I feel like I want to just grab the beauty blender and just do it myself, but I am doing it myself. because I don't trust myself with the blender, I'm gonna go in with a um, a brush and just do the bits that are tricky. Oh look, and I've got glitter everywhere. I feel like my wrist is getting achy. I don't do enough of my left hand. Like, this is an exercise. It's having itself a little workout. Chloe Ting, what? I'm gonna be using the Makeup Gallery Hide and Cheek Foundation stick, but actually concealer stick, sorry, but this is in a darker shade and I use this one for cream contour. I'm going to set this using the Makeup Gallery Smoothly Does It Press Powder. This is obviously from Poundland and it's one of the best ones I've ever used, which is why I use it, because it's a pound and it does exactly what it says on the little plastic tin. This is also where it could go 
horribly, horribly wrong. <laughs> We're about to do my eyebrows. Now I'm gonna be going in with my B by Superdrug Longwear Brow Cream, and I'm gonna be using the B by Superdrug Brow Gel along with the Morphe Brow Brush. I'm only gonna take a tiny bit because I don't wanna ruin it. <laughs> Fluffy. Breathe. <laughs> oh, just stabbed my palette, sorry. I'm like, I'm trying not to get my arm, like I'm having to hold my arm with my other arm. <laughs> like just can't reach. That one's thicker. What have I done? I've ruined it. I'm now taking the Revolution Vintage Lace Blush Set and I freaking love these. They're so pretty. Look how cute they are. They're so pretty. I normally wear eyeliner every day. This is not happening today. It's just not gonna happen. Eyeliner can sense fear. If you're scared, there's don't even bother. Don't even bother, girl. Just walk away. I'm being a little bit cheeky because I'm going with my CoverGirl mascara. Now this is not a wet mascara, so hopefully I don't get any um, mascara all over my eyelids. Ofo. Right. Right, that's gonna have to do. I'm gonna now go in with my Primark lip liner in the shade Scarlet, and then on top of that, I'm gonna be putting my Morphe by Jeffree Star lipstick in the shade Unicorn Blood. Whoops. Ah, no! That is the best that's gonna get. I still have a little stain. <laughs> Lastly, I'm going in with my Maybelline Face Studio Chrome Extreme in the shade Met Metallic, no, Molten Rose Gold. And this is going to be going on my cheekbones. And then we are done, so, ready? Is that shiny enough? I think I need some more. Right guys, that is the absolute final look, all using my left hand, and I absolutely promise you guys, I've got pins and needles running down this because it's just not used to this kind of work. <laughs> so, I am actually quite happy with that. I don't think that's bad at all, really, for left hand stuff. I mean, I could have blended those a bit more, but you know when it gets to a point where you think, I shouldn't really touch this because if I touch it, it's gonna get worse. So, yeah, I'm really happy with that. And it's the look that I wanted. Like I said to you guys, this is a collab, so that means that a load of other brilliant creators, honestly, these are creators that I watch weekly, I watch all of their videos, and I really, really like these girls. They've all done this video. I've put in, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna put all of their channels in the description box down below so you can go and check it out. That said, if you like this video, please don't forget to smash that like button. It helps me out so, so much, and I love creating content for you guys, and I love meeting you guys. If you're new here and you haven't yet done so, please consider subscribing, it's completely free. It just means you're notified next time I post anything. What has happened? I shit you not, I just got goosebumps like a ghost had walked through me or something. Yes, yeah, so that's completely free. It just means you're notified next time I post anything new and I post content twice a week on Thursdays and Sundays in between four and five. Um, thanks so much for watching this video. Thanks for being here. I really, really hope you have a fantastic day, evening or weekend, wherever you are in the world. And I really, really hope that I get to see you again in the next one. Until then, love you, bye.